Sharks lost their ninth consecutive game tonight. I mean, that not that crazy? Nine losses in a row. Uh, the Sharks lost tonight to the Dallas Stars in regulation by a final score of 2-1. to one. This game was in Dallas. Um, and yeah, and the Sharks, uh, for them in net, they had Kapo Kakanen, who kind of has a history of not playing super good against the Dallas Stars. Um, and he did okay today. I mean, he had a 9-2-3 save percentage. He was 24 of 26. But I mean, at the end of the day, the Sharks lost. And I think... The Dallas Stars, the fact that they scored the only goal in the first period, um, that kind of set the tone for the game. And the Stars were able to, you know, capitalize and then score once again in the second period. Um, so I think, you know, Kakanen giving up that first period goal, it sort of set the tone for the game. Um, and so, you know, the Stars were very aggressive very early on. Um, and so, yeah, uh, Tyler Sagan got a goal in the first period. It was a very nice pass from Jamie Benn. And um, yeah, it was pretty early on in the game as well, uh, close to about five minutes in. That's when Sagan scored the first goal. Um, in the second period, the Sharks had a goal from Timo Meyer. It was a pretty nice goal. Um, and so, yeah, I mean, the Sharks were pretty equal to the Stars when it came to shots. Um, and I mean, the, you know, the Stars were playing aggressive. They were, they're, they're eyeing a playoff push. Um, and, uh, you know, they're not really in super much of a position right now, but they're eyeing that playoff berth. Um, yeah, for the Sharks, of course, that goal from Meyer, but the Stars also had a goal from Michael Raffle, and uh, he scored as well in the second period. There were no goals in the third. Um, both teams scored in the second. It was even, so the Sharks had no opportunity to, uh, you know, take the lead or even tie it in the third because, you know, the Stars' defense was pretty good, um, and the Stars had a good game from Jake Ottinger, who saved 23 of 24 in net with a 9.58 save percentage. Um, the Sharks, you know... I, I mean, I think the goalie matchup tonight was pretty equal. Um, when it was all said and done, Kokkinen and Ottinger had a pretty good um, matchup. I mean, they were both pretty equal. And I think the Sharks and uh, Stars offense was pretty equal. I mean, both had the same amount of shots about, roughly. Um, yeah, I mean, the Stars played pretty good in this one, though. Um, and they're, like I said, they're, they're definitely eyeing a playoff spot. The Sharks are just really playing for nothing at this point. So, you know, I think the, the level of aggressiveness, I could just tell, was different. Um, and, uh, yeah, I mean, the Sharks, I think, need to have better, uh, discipline as well. I think that's an issue right now with them. And, um, so the Sharks, they had a good opportunity, however, though, when they were on the power play, um, later on after, uh, Noah Gregor drew a hooking penalty, but, you know, they just couldn't get it done. Their power play unit is not very strong. So the Sharks couldn't convert in that sense. Um, yeah, so, I mean, after this one, the Sharks went to 29, 34, and 11, Stars moved to 43, 27, and 5. I mean, these teams are very much different in terms of how good they are. But the funny thing is, the, the Dallas Stars division is a lot harder than the Sharks division. So they find themselves in fifth place. Um, you know, they have the Avalanche and Blues in, in their division. So, you know, those are two teams that are very strong. The Wild, I mean, that's the top three. And then it's just them and the Predators are neck and neck. So they're de very much, like, in position to hopefully for them, you know, make a playoff push. Um, but the Sharks... On the other hand, bottom of their division, uh, that's, you know, has some strong teams in it, but not as strong. It's the Flames kind of running away with it at this point. And, um, yeah, I mean, the Sharks, they remain at 69 points and uh, Stars are at 91. So it's just a big difference. But, I mean, I guess in terms of play tonight, the teams didn't play too much different um, in terms of, like, level of production. But that's how it was. Uh, and the Sharks in their next game, they will play the Minnesota Wild. Uh, so it's a back-to-back -back and uh, another against another central team like that. So anyways, guys, that's going to do it. The Sharks lose to the Dallas Stars by a final score of 2-1. to one. Let me know your thoughts. I'll see you guys later. And yeah, go Sharks.